Hey guys, it's Jordan. Um, obviously lit the candle, but whatnot. Um, so I'm going to be posting this on YouTube and Facebook. Um, apparently I never knew any of these things. Um, it's International Suicide Awareness Day today, um, 9-10-2015, or obviously any other year that's come, but yeah, so obviously I have my own problems with it. I've done it a few times. Even that's an understatement. I know it's hard to talk about these kinds of things. I mean, obviously. Maybe if I talked about it or something, I wouldn't have done half these things, but probably would have because home life. Um, just know I'm always here for you. Um, yeah, so anyone that's ever attempted or plan on attempting it, just know I'm here, okay? I'm never going to go anywhere. Unless that one day, even though I'm making this video not to do it, I eventually do it. It's the only time I'll ever go. But, I don't know. I want to try to make a difference as much as I can. So, anyone that's ever succeeded, family that knows of someone that succeeded with suicide, I'm sorry. But at least if they know that you're doing stuff like this as I am, you're showing you care, and you obviously miss them. And as any of my friends on Facebook, whether I know you or not, Build their cells. I'd feel it in the heart. It's not a joke or anything. All those people that have committed suicide that I don't even know because of bullying and all that stuff. Calling someone some stupid word down the hallway. You're you think it's hilarious. You get a laugh with your friends while they're going in the bathroom cutting or crying their eyes out until they get home and try to do something, some succeed of hanging their self or whatnot. Just because some simple word they take to heart. <clears throat> Oops, I accidentally blew out the candle. <laughs> but yeah, I don't remember what I was saying, but <clears throat> I got diagnosed with depre severe depression a few years ago. Um, I don't take any medication. Um, I tried it before. It doesn't work. I don't like it. Um, I have like severe anger issues and all that. So they want me to go back on medication or try it or do something with it. But to be honest, I'm not going to do medication. That's not my thing. Never will be. So people that suffer with that, I mean, we were born on the planet without any of these guns, weapons, food of sorts, houses, <clears throat> medication, or anything like that. It was us humankind. God gave us all these flaws for a reason, and it's not just to wash them away. I mean, some are broken more than usual, but I don't know. It's not just something we should change for the fuck of it. I feel like I can work with these problems around. I said this more than once as I fuck up or something. But at least I'm really trying. And I really show it once in a while. I mean, if you know me, you should know. I try. But I know life gets hard. We all want to die in the end. Eventually we will, but... For the people around you that care... Whether you see it or not, don't do it. I'm a person that I'm I'm here for you. I won't go anywhere. If I don't message you back just like that or not, my bad, but I promise I'll get to you. If you have any concerns or anything, I know some people are like, 
Well, he's just saying that to get attention for this website or whatever, some shit like that. No. I want to make a difference. Not be, be judged by, like, a book from its cover, because trust me, been done that to way too much. That's the reason why I cut and do all that stuff, because I don't have time for that. I have time for you guys. I want to make a difference in your life. I want to be famous, obviously, by singing, but also by making a difference. And it starts tonight, too. And when I become famous, I don't want to be like all those assholes that's like hiding behind the cameras with these smug looks. I want to... If I want to die, I want to die trying to be there for someone. Not trying to hide from the whole social media. I know they will probably make a thousand stories about me, but the true stories will be on the videos that I make. But everyone that has those suicide ideas needs to keep their head up. Just know I'm praying for you, even the ones that are gone, your family, your friends, your loved ones, everything like that. I'll pray for them tonight, just as I blow out this candle towards the end of this video. I care for you, whether I know you or not. Even the people that I randomly friend request, and you're probably like, what the fuck? Who the hell is this person that randomly friend requested me? I'm here to make a change, not just make a friendship. Of course, I want that super much, because that starts with the change. But, yeah. Think before you do. All those people that committed suicide today, and... 14 hours from now, and every single state, there's probably a suicide being done right now as I speak. Be there for that person, as I'm here for everyone that's not even cutting or doing anything like that. I'm here for you. Before you even get those ideas, depression and all that, I know how it works. I have severe anxiety. It's not fun. When I go in school, I feel like I'm being judged like 24-7, even though I'm not in it or not. I'm just walking down the street. I am being judged. I pay attention to my falls way too much than I should. I should just keep my head held high, but it's kind of hard when you get knocked down so much. Talk to your family. Get help or anything like that, because I don't want any of my friends to die tonight or any other night. So make this night Suicide Awareness Night. A difference. So please post a video like this or not. Like and comment my video. Share it. Make a difference in other people's lives. Try to stop them. I'm always a person you can be here to talk to. So many years from now, I'm going to be here for you unless I'm dead or behind bars or something. Different story. <laughs> but. <clears throat> Let's just do a prayer, all right, about all the people that's passed. Because I do believe in God, shockingly enough, with all my personality choices. <clears throat> all right. Dear God, for all the people that have committed suicide this day and any other day that comes forward or before, you know the world's tough, obviously, considering you built it. Grant them another heaven. Just because they weren't strong enough to take all your past doesn't mean they weren't worthy enough to be in your race. I'm sure you know this. Keep to all our loved ones that have succeeded in suicide or tried, attempted. Let us know they'll be going to heaven tonight or any other night. Keep them strong. Keep us strong. Keep all our loved ones strong, safe. Let everyone that watches this video, let their loved ones know they love them and care. Let all my friends know I love them and keep them safe in your care. Thank you, God, for giving us all the strength to fight this much and not actually die.
Thank you for keeping us alive for all our friends and family. Thank you for keeping me alive. Not succeeding suicide and all that because I know how many people I'll destroy. Thank you for all the chances you have gave me to still be here right now to make this video for the people that are watching. Everyone that's watching, make them safe. And let them be able to pray to you and keep them safe. We all love you so very much. And from me, God, tell everyone that's actually committed suicide, I care about them and I love you, even though I rather do not know them. I love you, God. Everyone, we all say, Amen. So, hopefully, you watch this video and you subscribe to me on YouTube. And follow me on Facebook and add me and all that. And you respect this video. Suicide ain't a good thing. I attempted it way too much. I've seen way too much of it in my life. I don't want to see any of my friends actually in a cast it from succeeding this. Everyone hold up your candles. Blow away all the pain. All the death. All the blood that was shed tonight. I may not have made this at 830, but good as I can. And please thank Kaylee Fuller, my best friend in the whole wide world, for making this video and keeping her strong with her choices she's made. I love you, Kaylee Fuller. Follow my heart. Thank you for watching. <sighs>